So guys, there are mainly four kinds of frames in Adobe Animate. Let me demonstrate them. Make a new layer. Now if we look closely, our frame symbol is different than the previous one. The new symbol look like this, where the circle is empty. And this is known as blank frame, because this frame do not have any kind of objects. Now if we draw something, see the symbol changed. And this symbol is called keyframe. As the name suggests, the keyframe is very important because we use keyframe to make animations. Let me show you. Go to the next frame. To insert keyframe, press on F6 or click on this button. Now both the first frame and second frame have the same image. Now select the second frame and make some change like another line. Now if we move our playhead, see? Suppose we don't want to change this picture until 10th frame. For that, Select the 10th frame and insert another keyframe, F6. Now do the change you want. Suppose we want to move this line. Now if we move the playhead, first image for one frame, second image for ninth frame, and after 10th frame, we have our third image. That's why these are called keyframes. Now the third one where the circle is white. This indicates that our frame have some kind of filter or effects. So let's try it. Select the frame, go to right side, properties, frame, and at the bottom we have our filter. Click on this plus icon. Let's add drop shadow, increase the distance, blur. See, now our icon have white circle. The fourth one, normal frame. If we move our playhead here, we are at 47th frame. But suppose we want to extend our clip or layer to frame 16th. For that, we need to select the frame, then F5 or click on insert frame, like this. Lastly, what is auto keyframing? As you can see around here, we inserted our keyframe manually. But suppose we want to insert this keyframe automatically. For that, free transform tool, select the object, enable auto keyframing, then move the playhead and move your subject. See the Adobe Animate automatically inserting the keyframes when we are changing something. So guys that's all about frames in Adobe Animate. Thank you guys for watching. Have a good day.